Hey guys, today I'm going to be playing Splatoon, a little bit of Splatoon, or am I? This is actually not Splatoon. It is, however, a Chinese bootleg called Sepian Go, which uses the assets and likenesses of Nintendo's Splatoon. This game, however, is not made by Nintendo and is actually kind of illegal. But I'm going to be playing it anyway, just to kind of show you it. Right. That looks like a good character. Let's do this. Hopefully the mic is okay. This game, this game is entirely in Chinese. So I don't really know what it says. I just kind of have to guess. Let's make a name here. All right. Did it, did it even? There we go. It's got a. There we go. Got my name. Um, not sure why this isn't working, but uh, let's just try QWERTY. There we go. I got it now. So. This game is literally just Splatoon on mobile. It has everything here. It's the same overworld everything. It's basically the same game. So let's see if I can get into a match here. It's kind of uh, iffy, the entire thing. So uh, I guess English is, the, is a good one. Let's see here. See, it uses the same music, everything. I'm not sure if it's actually, the music actually comes through or not. But if it is, you would be able to, you know, tell that it is. So, just, uh, kind of got to wait it out now. Matches typically take a pretty long time, so I'm just going to sit here and wait it out. If you're interested in about getting this game, uh, I can put the uh, link to the game into uh, in the description. But it be warned, it's only for Android. So sorry, iOS users. I've ran out of things to say. There we go. Finally. Okay, just got to wait for everybody to load. It kind of takes a bit. This game is kind of a bootleg. I'm not even sure if there's servers in the, U the U.S. or not. I might just be running this from China. In fact, it probably is. <sighs> got to wait for the MDKZ4. Oh, wait, no, not just the other guy. Wonderful. Yay. Okay. I'm just going to play a match. And then I'll end the video. It's the same music, everything. I actually, I think it looks pretty good for being on mobile. It has an okay control scheme.
So, sorry, I'm not talking too much, but uh, it's this kind of reminds me of the Overwatch thing that happened a little bit ago. The over the Overwatch bootleg. There we go, finally. Okay. It's actually it's really fun. It's I'm not sure how long the servers are actually gonna be up because uh until Nintendo shuts them down. I'm kinda hoping they don't. I mean it's pretty bad to say, but uh But, uh, because this is actually really, really fun. Like, sorry, it's, I kind of forgot to reset my control scheme. Not. This is very intense gameplay. Anyway, well, I think you get the gist, but I'm gonna just gonna finish up the two minutes. Now I'm gonna upload it. There we go. I'm not sure how they died. That kind of that kind of confuses me. Okay cool thing about this game is you can actually teleport wherever you want to well if your uh, side is dominating it, that is which I actually really like that I'm not sure if that's in the real regular Splatoon and I haven't played that game in forever I don't really I'm not very good at it so I don't play it very much because I got it after everybody was already like super high levels All right, like every the, all the music's the same if you can't tell. Actually, doing really good. I'm not see. There's a bit of glitching around, you know. Doesn't work all. It always doesn't always work exactly how it's supposed to. But I mean, it's a bootleg from China, so I mean. I think I got that person. <laughs> Man, we're just we destroyed them. All right, just gonna let it finish up. So I think you got the basic just literally just the same game. Literally, just the same game as Splatoon. So, well, I mean. I guess that makes sense, because they only had two people on their team. They didn't win, but... Well, this that's going to be the uh, end of this video. It's very fun. Splatoon, uh, Nintendo's probably going to take it down. 
get it while you can if you have an Android. Alright, peace.